was a detailed bomb threat aimed at one of Albuquerque's busiest school campuses. But very few people knew it was going on. In fact, students and faculty went about their day on the main CNM campus, totally unaware of the situation. And now some of them are asking why. Here's News 13's Crystal Gutierrez. Uh, no, I wasn't informed uh, on the bomb threat. Did you hear anything about it? I wasn't either. I didn't know anything about it. Students had no idea that last Thursday a man called CNM threatening to blow up the school. The call was enough for security to be alerted. An email highlighting details about the call was sent to them, saying who got the call and what the man said. The email read a bomb was going to explode on the campus between the hours of 12 noon and 5 p.m. on that day. More than 16,000 students are enrolled at CNM's main campus. Double that number are registered for the college's text and email alert system. Not one got a message because the campus did not send one out. Why? Because officials say the alert system is only used if it's deemed there was an immediate threat. In this case, in that case, it was deemed that it was not. Samantha Single says APD was notified and helped with the bomb threat investigation before determining it was a hoax. They can't tell us how that was determined, citing safety reasons, and they also can't tell us how long it took to determine that it was a fake bomb threat. How quickly did you guys determine it was a hoax? I don't know that um, specific information at this time. Students we spoke with say even 10 minutes of not knowing if that bomb threat is real or not could have spelled out danger for them. Even if it was a fake bomb threat, people should still know about it so they can prepare for their safety at least. School officials say that would be the wrong thing to do. Why not alert the students at that time? It would create chaos. Um, the, the last thing we want to do is to create a situation where we're creating our own emergency by uh, creating panic and, and alerting individuals to something that isn't actually a true threat. Well, one of the reasons people are wondering about this is that last semester, CNM did lock down its Northeast Heights campus and sent out text and email alerts when a man on a nearby city bus claimed that he had a bomb. CNM officials said APD determined in that case there was a possible threat, but it also turned out to be a hoax.